नमस्कार आई एम डॉक्टर अमित भारद्वाज साइंटिस्ट फ्रॉम इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट आई वेलकम यू ऑल फॉर द टूडेज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग फॉर सिक्स ऑफ जुलाई नाउ एज यू कैन सी इन दिस स्लाइड सो दीज आर द टूडेज हाईलाइट द ऑन गोइंग इंटेंस रेनफॉल स्पेल लाइकली टू कंटिन्यू ओवर कॉनकन एंड गोवा एंड गुजरात रीजन एंड द ऑन गोइंग इंटेंस रेनफॉल स्पेल ओवर साउथ फाइनेंसलर ऑफ इंडिया इज लाइकली टू डिक्रीज फ्रॉम सेवंथ ऑफ जुलाई and you can also see that there are enhanced rainfall activity over central part of india uh, over 6th and 8th and which will uh, be gradual increase in uh, over northern parts of india from 9th july for subsequent two days so these are the highlights now we'll see uh, what are the weather observation for past 24 hours so as you can see these uh, different colors are representing uh, different uh, 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 colors for the different rainfall amount as you can see dark color is for heavy rainfall and the orange is for heavy to very heavy and the red is is for heavy to very heavy with extremely heavy rainfall so uh, isolated extremely heavy rainfall have been reported over kerala and konkan and goa regions and the orange color you can see the very heavy rainfall at, uh, at isolated places are uh, occurred over rajasthan madhya pradesh uh, uh, gujarat region uh, coastal karnataka madhya maharashtra bihar north east states and uh, many others you can see from this figure and the heavy rainfall in the dark you can see gangetic west bengal and sikkim uh, jharkhand uh, vidarbha madhya maharashtra telangana uh, coastal andhra pradesh saurashtra kutch even you can see from uh, haryana as well as uh, uh, himachal pradesh so these are the uh, past 24 hours rainfall amount and uh, been shown in this picture now if we, if we discuss what are what are the today's uh, synoptic system as you can see in this figure there is a monsoon trough line which is south of its normal position and there is also a western disturbance which lies uh, roughly along 70 degree east and 28 uh, degree north we can also see there is a presence of cyclonic circulation uh, over north pakistan and uh, adjoining punjab region and uh, there is also a cyclonic circulation present over odisha and uh, Gangetic West Bengal and uh, no, adjoining North Odisha. We can also see there is a cyclonic circulation over North East Arabian Sea, uh, adjoining uh, uh, Gujarat, and uh, there is also a uh, presence of the offshore trough which passes from uh, South Gujarat to North uh, Kerala region, and there is also a shear zone, east-west shear zone, uh, which is uh, uh, seen at 4.5. between 4.5 and uh, 7.6 uh, km above mean sea level so these are the uh, today's synoptic system due to these therefore re- rainfall uh, has a- occurred so so five days rainfall warning has been issued from the imd and as you can see uh, for let us discuss about day one so these are different color representing the different uh, amount of rainfall as mentioned earlier so the red color warning are been issued for the entire coast of uh, west coast of india so uh, the extremely heavy rainfall uh, uh, can occur over isolated places over kerala konkan and goa and uh, ck so these are extremely heavy rainfall also at isolated places over assam and meghalaya uh, extremely ha- uh, rainfall can occur for the uh, day one that means 6th of july today and for other orange warning has been issued from and you can see that very heavy rainfall can occur over gujarat region uh, odisha uh, jharkhand chatisgarh uh, arunachal pradesh west up uttarakhand for uttarakhand day 1 to day 5 as you can see uh, the very heavy rainfall uh, warning has been issued and the heavy rainfall uh, for the rest of india as you can see in this picture so these uh, heavy rainfall spell will continue from today and uh, uh, tomorrow but these uh, will decrease after tomorrow that means for day 3 day 4 and day 5 these uh, rainfall spell heavy rainfall spell or very heavy rainfall spell will uh, decrease over from south peninsula of india but you can see that these spell will continue over northern part of the india uh, for 9th july and 10th july and these are the five days warning as you can see here now if we uh, come to the fisherman warning graphics for the ocean side as you can see these are the polygons been drawn for day 1 day 2 day 3 day 4 and day 5 and these uh, different colors are representing based on the wind speed as well as uh, squally weather as you can see over the 
coastal entire coast of uh, west coast of india uh, uh, is uh, uh, been marked with this polygon that means fishermen are not advised to venture in these areas so for day 1 to day 5 as you can see these are the areas where fishermen are not advised to go so you can uh, different uh, more information you can gain from these graphics and uh, you can also follow us uh, uh, check the updates for imd website as well as you can follow us for uh, weather updates on twitter instagram and youtube thank you for today mm -hmm.